welcome back to after effects master class now let us start the interface so after installation we open the after effects so this is the interface of after effects you can change the workspace into default go to workspace workspace default and reset the default so this is the default workspace that after is given so in here this is the project window you can import the old file and you, this is the composition you can preview this is timeline in bottom timeline and here is the fx window and um, here are the all the windows for example fx project window if you miss any window you can get the window from here for example timeline means so you can access the timeline again from window so you can access any window from here if you miss project window and everything you can access so here is the fx control window so this is the basic interface of after effects now for starting a new project you should create a new composition in premiere is called sequence so create a new composition you can create a new composition from here in from here also control n is the shortcut now here is some things you need to know so you can change the composition name here and also you can change the height and width means your videos output means video resolution so you know what is resolution so for example full hd if you are searching in video resolution in google okay mm, I, ah, this is better full hd means one one nine two zero into one zero eight zero that is the full hd size and height and width of the full hd quad and 4k full hd size 4k size one nine two zero that's the full hd size so you can if you want the full hd video one nine two zero and one zero eight zero you can type one that value here and it's already preset in top you can access lot of preset here just like premiere you can 4k resolution here you don't need to type height and width you can access a lot of preset for example if you want uh, something different uh, for example portrait mode for instagram stories so you can 1080 you can type customly and if you press ok you can see the mobile size here i just deleted and create a new combo again and if you want square size for instagram you can type 1080 you will get a square type and if you want instagram post 1080 means 3 is to 4, 4 is to 5 so you will get the instagram post size so you can create a custom size also so just just created a full hd 1080 and right now you can access the frame rate 24 25 29 30 so i will explain what is frame rate probably you know but anyway i will explain what is frame rate so frame rate means frame per second as a frame in a second for example 25 fps means in a second 25 images you can see here 10 fps means only 10 fps in a second means uh, 30 fps mean 30 frames in a second so this is my malayalam premier pro master class so if you want to create a slow motion video you should uh, you should capture the video in high fps means for example 120 fps in a second 120 images so you can reduce the frames and you can create a slow motion video like this so i will explain deeply fps means 25 30 120 240 fps you can available 
lot of fps but why frame rate matters is very important because we can choose the best uh, fps based on our output for example if you are working for movie uh, for most of movies fps is 24 and 24 means in a second there is a 24 images in here i will show you the example in a means like this 24 images everything is a one images that is the frames so in here i will example 30 fps so one frame is a image 24 for movies 34 broadcast if you are watching any tv channel tv that's for 30 fps means 30 images per second and 64 fps for some movies hobbit movies shooter in 60 fps we can get a smoother and 120 fps 240 fps this is for ultra slow motion this is this video shooted by 120 fps iphone so you can get the smooth uh, slow motion um, with this 120 or 240 fps i think a lot of one right now i will they provide the, this fps video in their camera and these are the frame rate so if you are working with broadcast so you should create a 30 fps if you are working for a movie you should go with 24 so right now i am using 30 fps and duration in duration is hour minutes second frames here is the frames right now 30 fps so if you want five second or you can had here zero five in second because hour minute is second and if you want 5.5 second you should add in here is it frame rate is 30 so you should add the half of frame rate means 15 right now is a 5.5 fps do you get me so if you apply the 30 fps means one second so it's automatically changed into six second so it's very simple but try with these things so don't worry you can change later the duration and everything you can change later and background color press ok that's it so you create a new composition now this is a timeline and composition window and you can change every time okay i just create another composition combo one comb two so here you can access combo one comb two everything in different different size okay i just deleted the comb two in here only comb one now window uh, this is my these are the workspace you can available in com and these are my favorite workspace so reset the favorite so here is project here is fs control composition and text effects and everything here and bottom side is timeline and if you want to create your own favorite composition you can change the i just change into rig and so sometime i use my if i work with cat rigging i use this project timeline so here is completely timeline here is completely composition center is fx and project window so if you have a change into default and if you have if you have any f favorite composition so just default and reset you should reset every time if you are changing to a new workspace you should reset so you can create your own favorite 
composition you favorite workspace like this you can drag and drop you can drop the windows like this and after that if you are creating your own favorite effect your own favorite windows so you can save this workspace in here save as a new workspace so you can change into your favorite anyway this is my window this is my workspace it's not necessary to learn but just understand that's it now let us start working with after effects so you should remember the sequence importance of composition and frame rate and everything and you can import the video like this file import file you can import the file like this or you can import the file just drag and drop for example uh, select the video so, or select the images and drag and drop into project window because project window is very important we import the all file and all elements into project window so you can drag and drop or go to file and drop.